For generations, local families have made the Linden Lore access point to the Finley River a popular place to go fishing and swimming. Now, after years of legal battle over whether parts of that area are private or public property, the Missouri Court of Appeals has unanimously ruled in favor of those pushing to keep it open. Color 10's Joshua Pineda live outside the Court of Appeals in Springfield. But Josh, you made the visit to Linden Lore today to talk with people who will now be able to access that area for good. That's right. I counted about eight cars when I was there earlier this afternoon, and I spoke with one man who says he's been going to that very same spot since he was little. Absolutely. Humanity and nature are what we survive off of. From generation to generation, Derek Sawkill is thankful for the court's ruling and keeping the Linden Lore access open to the public because now he gets to bring his kids to one of his favorite places. I've been coming here since I was a kid with my family, uh, my grandparents, my mom and dad. Uh, it's a good place for community, like if you want to get away with your kids and fish, catch small fish, bring them out here and teach them a lesson. But Sawkill says just because this area is open to the public doesn't mean visitors should leave trash everywhere. If there's alcohol bottles and stuff, just pick it up. If you drink, it'd be safe and responsible. For more than a century, locals have made Linden Lore Access a popular spot to relax and enjoy nature. But in 2020, Landowners put up a barrier blocking Canyon Road, which leads to the Linden Lore access, stating because it was on their property, they could block it off. But after the judge ruled in favor of the public, visitors like Justin Timmy can enjoy the river without any worries. But you know, it's just a nice place and we want to keep it nice and we like to bring our kids out here. It's a great place, especially if you like, you know, that, that kind of white noise sound and playing in the water and stuff like that. And I also spoke with David Romano with the Finley River Coalition, who led the charge in making sure that Linden Lore was open to the public. And he says he could not be more thrilled with the court's ruling. Reporting in Springfield, I'm Joshua Pineda, Color 10 News.